Welcome to the technical studies. In this video, we will learn how to lay out a three-cut mitre bend. Please like and comment. For the sample, we will use a 6-inch diameter pipe. Outer diameter of a 6-inch pipe is nearly 168 mm. This is a long radius mitre bend. How to calculate the center radius of a long radius elbow? Multiply the pipe size by 1.5. 1.5 is a constant. Here, the answer is 228 millimeters. Draw the center line of the mitre with a radius of 228 millimeters. Mark 84 millimeters on both sides of the center line and draw arcs. To determine the degree of the parts A and D, divide 90 degrees by 6. This is a common rule for 90 degree 3 cut mitre bends. To determine the degree of the parts B and C, divide 90 degrees by 3. Divide the arc as shown. Draw the line AB parallel to the line OE. Measure the distance from O to B. And mark the same distance on lines OC and OD. Draw lines connecting BC, CD, and DE. Similarly, draw lines 1 to 2, 2 to 3, 3 to 4, and 4 to 5. Draw a half circle and divide it as shown. Draw lines B2, C3, D for etc. Draw lines 6M, 5L for K etc. parallel to 7N. Calculate the circumference of the pipe. Pipe circumference is equal to pipe diameter multiplied by 3.1 for 2. Is equal to nearly 528 millimeters. Draw a line with a length of 528 millimeters. And divide the line to 12 equal parts. Each part will be 44 millimeters long. Measure the distances A1, P2, Q3, etc., and take notes. Draw vertical lines as shown. Draw a line that flows smoothly between one, two, three points. Draw a line perpendicular to the line N7. The length of the line shall be 528 millimeters. Divide the line into 12 equal parts in the same way as before. Note down the dimensions N7, M6, L5, K for etc. and draw lines as shown. Draw lines as you have done before. For segments C and D, create opposite layouts as shown. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like. If you have any suggestions, please comment.